So, we're gonna introduce two skills today. Actually, yeah, just two. I'm gonna teach you guys how to add integers and I'm gonna teach you how to multiply integers. So, here we go. A positive plus a positive is a? Positive. Negative. Who, who said negative? If you have five dollars and you get five more dollars, how many dollars do you have? Ten dollars. So a positive plus a positive is a? Positive. Is a positive. What if I have negative seven plus positive 10. What's 10 minus 7? Three. 3. Now, this is the tricky part. This is the part that confuses us. Step 2 is you keep the sign of greater number. Which number is bigger, guys? The 10 or the 7? 10. Is 10 positive or negative? So what's our answer going to be? Positive three. All right, let's try another one. Now I'm going to try one to trick you. Uh, 13 plus negative 20. Talk at your table. Talk at your table. See if you can come up with the answer. Talk at your table. OK, well, let's, let's talk about our rules. What's the first thing we need to do with those two numbers? OK, so what's 20 minus 13? Put your hands on your head when you know the answer. Give yourself a nice little check. Make sure you're good to go. So pay attention. We're going to multiply integers, and then I'm turning you guys loose. A negative times a negative. This is the tricky one. Everybody's like, what? It's a positive. Is a positive. What? Yep. Shh. And a negative times a positive is a negative. A uh, negative 13 times positive. This is a hard one, Tammy. You might not get that one. Who are you hollering at? Negative 13, is he right? Yes. All right, so listen up, y'all. Raise your hand if you feel confident and you're ready to try this. Ready? Raise your hand if you're tired of hearing me talk and you're ready to just get to work. Okay, so here's what you're going to do. Pay attention. First side, get it done, it's going to be signed. That way we're making sure you guys are understanding what you're doing. Second side, get it done. That way we make sure you guys are doing the right thing. We don't want to do the wrong thing over and over. When you're finished with that page, you're going to flip it over. And I'm not going to have you do this page. So you're just going to go to the side that says hashtag PPP. What does PPP stand for? Preparation powers performance.